What's going on guys, as Nick Show back with another video. I don't normally do um, shirt videos or clothing videos like this, but I did pick up Kai Bentley's brand Strawberry. If you guys watching don't know who Kai Bentley is, Kai did a bunch of YouTube videos back in the day. He doesn't do videos anymore, but uh, Kai, huge fan. Enjoy the videos. Hopefully you come back. I know you're busy hanging out with Drake and just having a great time and enjoying life. Can't hate on that. Um, also, his brothers Levi. Levi stopped also doing YouTube videos, I believe. Jet still does videos with, with uh, his dad or their dads too, sir. But yeah, just huge fan of the brand, the family. The family just produces amazing content. I think it was a couple years ago, Kai initially dropped the blue long sleeve. I think that was the first shirt he ever dropped. It was like a blue long sleeve. It fit terribly on me. I bought a large. It didn't fit. I gave it to my brother. It, felt, it fit more like a medium back then. And I just really didn't. I was like, I was in my phase, right? I used to be into like Babe Supreme, all that stuff. But now it's like, you know, I just live a simple life. I stream. I do YouTube. I don't really go out much, so I don't really need to buy a lot of clothes. But what really caught my eye was when Kai dropped the plain, it's just plain blank t-shirts. No design, nothing. The only design's on the tag. It is. It has his own strawberry branding on the tags. I bought three shirts. I bought the Mocha, Vintage Black, and True Black. And the total for all three plus shipping was to Hawaii. 168.64. Each shirt is $52, so it is pretty expensive. Or just a blank t-shirt. I mean, you guys already know. You could just go to like, you know, Uniqlo, Walmart, Target. Just pick up a blank t-shirt for a lot less. But as I decided to, you know, support the brand, support the movement. And yeah, each shirt came in one of these uh, strawberry baggies. I'll show the unboxing. Um, I'll pull it up on screen right now. Um, the shirts are folded very nicely. Ironed to the T. I don't know how it is when you manufacture shirts. But they are way less wrinkly than when you take them out of the dryer. So, iron to the T. Very nice. I do want to point out, Kai, if you see this video, I, I, I have a feeling I got a limited edition shirt because there's a white stain in the middle of my mocha shirt. I don't know if the coloring didn't get into the shirt or if Kai was getting freaky in the bedroom. I don't know. But that one shirt has a little stain, but it's okay. No harm, no foul done. I'm totally fine with that. Um, well, I'll let you guys know in the comments that the stain washed out. I just threw it in the watch this past weekend. But yeah, I just really, you know, like the brand. Um, I think Kai has really switched over to a brand that's very versatile. Um, you can wear the plain blank shirts with, you know, shorts, jeans, whatever you want to wear. You can wear them, you know, to bed at night. Um, if you got to go grocery shopping or, you know, fill up your gas tank, whatever you got to do, the shirts are there for you to just throw on with anything, which I just love. Like four or five years ago, younger Nick would have been like, you know, oh my God, you know, why are you wearing that ugly shirt? And I, you know, but who cares? Nowadays, like, who cares, you know? We're all going through tough times. We're all trying to save some money, invest. And I'm going to wear these shirts for uh, until like they fall apart and disintegrate. I mean, there's already some distressing because it comes with the shirt. There's distressing on the neckline um, by the uh, elbow and the, the bottom of the shirt. But I think it's kind of cool. I, it's, it's something different. You know, normally, I mean, back then, you know, that wasn't, uh, that kind of was a thing. But vintage has kind of come back or just wearing just like something that's more practical than just flexing with like a brand crispy new t-shirt. So there's some kind of appeal to it to me. Nowadays, I don't know about you guys. I was just overhearing a video um, earlier today, something about like the majority of wealthy people, you know, don't spend and splurge their money. Um, they save their money. And that's what I've kind of transitioned to over the past years. So the brand just kind of goes with what I am going for. You know, I still want to have some taste some style. At the same time, I just want to be very minimalistic. And I'll throw on um, a little try-on haul for you guys. So you guys can kind of be the judge. I normally wear a size large. I bought a size large. It To me, it was true to size. And actually uh, took one of my shirts out of the uh, the wash and dryer. And there's no you know shrinking. It's already pre-shrunk. But yeah, I'm not going to do a yes or no. Is it worth it? You know, that's up for you guys to decide. If you guys are fans of, you know, Kai. Kai's done videos for years and years and years. And I just thought, you know, it'd be kind of cool to support um, the cause. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys. I hope Kai releases more colors in the future. I also may want to check out the shorts. The shorts seem pretty cool as well. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I know this is kind of a pointless video unless you guys are friends of Strawberry. But, you know, it was something that I wanted to share with you guys. And I have a bunch of random videos coming out um, for the rest of this year. I'll, this is like my new thing, all right? We're grinding videos, whatever I feel like making. I post to the channel. If you guys like them, you like them. If you don't, you don't. Oh, and I'm streaming on Twitch. Four times a week, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday night, Saturday mornings, twitch.tv slash AzureNickDrowTV, link down below in the description. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night. Shoots.